point numbers. It just wasn't the type of game that he needed to play to, to be a leader. Skip pass from Bledsoe to mm. Massachusetts native huh. Terrence Mann, just like the Clippers opened up the other night. He cans a three. Six and a half to play in the first quarter. Celtics lead by one. Let's see if we get another quality shot here. Terrence Mann, again, you identify where the mismatch is at. If you can go into it one on one real quick before the defensive team can recover. Scoops to the hoop, blocked by Zoo, recovered by Mann. Terrence finds a seam, oh, down the hatch, leaping off the parquet for the flush. Terrence Mann, late in the clock, kicks it in the corner to Coffee. can he beat the buzzer? Good to the last drop once again. The three falls for Amir Coffee, and it's a 22-14 lead. It's fueling away, but sometimes that triple shot of espresso is a beautiful thing when you first get it. Time on the clock for Terrence Mann and the Clippers. Good find to an open Kennard for three. Nice. Oh, Jim and I closer than any Celtic defender and Kennard with his third bucket. The Celtics recoil defensively. Kennard tries to find a gap, finds man in the corner, fields it low, shoots it high, and rips the cords. Luke Kennard right here. He sprints down the court. You didn't see the beginning of it then. You got three Celtic players around him because they were trying to get back in transition to Terrence Mann. Brown hovers above the cup. No, Winslow with the rebound. Clippers have numbers if they push. Winslow from the line to the lane. They work it to Coffee. All alone for three. It's good. I should have known. Winslow who spins away from Brown. Back over to Kennard. Rifle one inside to man. Punches it in with the right hand. 62-59 Clippers. Terrence Mann right here able to sneak and play peekaboo in the baseline. Aggressive drive, finds Coffee in the corner. Man, yes. Swooping in and laying it in. Terrence Mann now with 14. It attracts grab, it grab, you know, it pulls things to him. That time, Xavier Moon was, Xavier Moon pulled three defenders to him. Brown for three. Rebound Bledsoe. And the Celtics, they don't foul Mann. Oh! the exclamation mark for the Clippers 91-82 17 points for you tonight uh, tell me where this game was won for the Clippers um, I think defensively early you know we kind of set the tone beginning of the game defensively um, and people making shots and that's always a great combination and also defensively in that fourth quarter as well um, right now you guys are playing with new faces every day uh, shoot around was canceled this morning. You've had limited practices. Can you just describe what that's been like for you guys as a team in terms of the communication and in terms of the preparation when you're having so much little access and, and new faces? Yeah, it's not easy. It's not easy, but you know, guys are interchangeable. We got a lot of guys who play multiple positions, and that helps a lot. You know, guys are playing positions they never played before, but they're playing hard and they can do multiple things, and that helps. I know you guys have been playing with the next man up mentality for a while now. Um, and you grew up about 30 minutes from here, Lowell, Massachusetts. I know you've got about 20 family yes, and friends. My friend. people are here. My people are here. It feels good to get a win at home. Um, you know, it's amazing. It's amazing. A lot of people from high school, uh, middle school. So it's great to see neighbors. It's, it's amazing. It's a home game for you in a sense, but it's the start of a pretty grueling stretch on the Clippers schedule. 14 games on the road from now until the end of January. That's the most for any team in the NBA during a stretch like that. How important was it to get the win here tonight? Oh, very important. Um, it's a great way to start this road trip that we're about to go on. Um, we're going to try and continue to do it by playing defense. Nice win. Thank you. All right, back to you guys. Jamie, great stuff. Local boy does good.